Hi, and welcome to my guide. Today, we're gonna be speedrunning Ernest the Chicken. And before we're actually gonna do the speedrun, let's go north and check if every door is open. This speedrun is really annoying and you need to be tick perfect, so every closed door is just a big problem. So what I'm gonna be doing is just closing and opening every door once again. So once I do the speedrun, then I'm sure that the doors will be open. Next one is next to the zombie. Close and open. Then the kitchen one. Both of them. Close and open. As well as the one towards the library. Close and open. And then the one next to the spade. The spade is located in the northwestern corner. Close and open. That's the final door. So let's set up the speedrun. Now you could wait until Veronica is at her most northern point. But that's uh, a lot of waiting. Right, once you think you are ready to do this speedrun. Let's talk to Veronica, select option 1 and then click to continue 3 times to start it. Next, let's go north and immediately drop the two tuna, they weigh way too much. Next, let's go north, go upstairs and grab the fish food. Once you have the fish food, immediately go back downstairs and let's complete the puzzle in the basement. Be sure to drink some energy potions on the way downstairs. Next to you is level B. Pull it, then A, south. After you've done that, go north and open the gate. The northern wall, pull level D. Next up, click on the ground, then go south, open the gate, click on the floor, and then pull a lever B. Click on the floor south towards lever A, and then pull lever A. Click on the floor, then go to open the northeastern gate. Click on the floor, then the western door, floor, then the northern door. Next is lever F, then the floor, then lever E, then on the floor, then the to eastern gate, floor, gate, then go to the eastern wall, pull lever C, go on to the floor, open the northwestern gate, floor, door, then floor and lever E, then floor, then eastern gate, floor, southern gate, floor, southern gate, floor, and then western gate, floor, oil can, all right, then the energy potion should be down. Floor and make our way back upstairs. Next up, let's pick up the poison. So first click on the lever and make our way to the poison and just keep spam clicking on it. Once we have that, let's run west. Let's run east to use the poison on the fish food and let's grab the spade. From the southeastern corner room in the northwestern corner. Once you have that, open the door and go anti clockwise around the manor. Go stand east of the compost heap. Alright, zoom out. East of the compost heap, southeastern corner. Use your spade on the compost heap. Once you have the key, Immediately go south and drop the spade, that weighs way too much. Go to the fountain, use your fish food on it, poisoned. Wait until you have they start floating, then search and keep pressing space until you have the pressure gauge. Then go back inside the manor and go towards the zombie underneath the staircase. Open the door, grab the rubber tube, 
go back out and let's go upstairs towards uh, Professor Hardenstein. 1% run energy, if you have that, be sure to click on it and grab that. Right, select option 1 and then 2 until you say that you are gonna grab the items for him. Once you see that, talk to Professor again and just keep pressing space that you hopefully complete this quest in time. Yes! Oh my god! I hate this quest so much. I have done this way too many times. OM Jesus Christ. Okay, thanks, bye.